I tricked you, didn't I? It wasn't actually the last episode. Gotcha! Totally. Hi. Welcome back to Siberia 2. It goes on. Of course it does. We're not done yet. We have to find Hans. We have to... Yep, nope, that, that's what we do. We, we have to find Hans. Let's find Hans. So, before we find Hans... Actually, I guess we'll... I was gonna say go talk to Igor, but I guess we'll try to use the snowmobile first. Because I'm pretty sure we have to do something with Igor before we can actually go up with a snowmobile. Like, maybe Igor has the key or something? I don't know. I can't quite remember. But let's check it out. I was about That's to save, like, brother, ten seconds in. That's the... Um, That's so, the... use it. That's... Take it. Use... use it. What do you... what? I guess I just need the key. The she should say that, like, the key is not in the ignition or something, but... Well, guess we just have to talk to Igor. And, yeah, everything else... Wait, this is new? No, that's... okay. And here, let me just confirm. If I go here and then down to... Oh! Yeah, that's new. Right? No, wait, we came... Oh, I see. We came from here and we went... He ah, okay. Wait. So, going here takes us right there. But going here will take us, like, up here on the same screen. Yeah, well, there. Cool. So let's talk to Igor and see what he's freaking out about. Hey, hi there. <gasps> Sorry. Whoa. Easy, cowboy. Igor, anyone there? <laughs> How's it going? Where's Hans? Hans? The old guy? Oh, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You kidnapped him. We left him on the snow bike. Oh. Me and Ivan. We went up a hill. Then I came down. Old man was gone. Vanished. How did you get up the hill? But that's impossible. He was very weak. It was like I say, lady. It's the truth. Well, Igor doesn't really seem like the kind of person that would lie. What's gotten into you, Igor? Have you lost the plot? I... Uh, I don't know. I'm cold. And I'm hungry. And there are spirits. I have a tasty Russian doll for you? Uh, I'm gonna wait with spirits and Is talk about the snowmobile and train Is first. It? Lucky. Without that. I'd like to borrow your snow bike. To get me to the top of the hill. Oh no, slope too slippery. Never get there. You need go up on foot. Ah. With crampons. Yeah, I was gonna say. Crampons. You can lend them to me. I can't do that, lady. Ivan would get angry. I was gonna say, like, surely the snowmobile wouldn't fare any better against a completely smooth ice slope than your feet. It would be more the other way around. Why did you steal the train? Ivan said it'd take us to Ivory. That we'd be rich princes. And why do you want to be a rich prince anyway? Hey, come on. Like, Ivan I can now, understand, Igor. but does you know, Igor even understand the concept the of being rich? Breath of death. I guess he just listens to Ivan. Devil. No, just the wind. I think you'll find blowing through the totem making a weird Oh, noise. fuck. Damn. <laughs> Pity poor Igor's soul. Aw. Igor don't want to die here. Uh, poor Igor. Gotta find some way to shake him out of it. I'll be back, Igor. Watch out. W -w 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 Watch out for spirits. Evil spirits. Okay, let's Igor? talk again. Ah. Nothing. Um, so now I have to save again, and I have to load again. Right. Oh, no. Ah, uh, this is like very far back. I'll be right back. Oh, man. And there we go. Oh, man. That took a while. 
should leave some more saves, I guess, so that doesn't happen again, but eh, it, I mean, it's a couple of minutes to replay, so I guess that's fine. But yeah, probably just gonna be like a line or two here. I just wanna see if she immediately says, it's the bird totem, without even having seen it. Because I'm assuming we knew it was the bird totem because we looked at it. So, let's see. Hey. Hey, what? hi. What? What? You... It... What's gotten? Uh... What was that? Spirits. There we go. <laughs> you know that spirits don't really exist, don't you? Yes. Yes. You could sh shamans summon spirits. Make us stop taking ivory. Okay, so don't take their ivory. Simple. They don't want their ivory. Ivan want ivory. Me, I want to go home. So why are you still here? I'm scared. Scared of evil spirits. Big boy like you and all. No, but well, I guess still, I've seen it all. why are you still here? If you're scared of the spirits that are here, wouldn't you just leave? Like, that doesn't make any sense. I'm going to stay here where the spirits are and where I'm terrified because I'm too scared to leave. I mean, I guess that makes sense. It or not it makes Why sense, but the fear is irrational oh, and stuff. What? Well, yeah, that's that's really all. And I guess if we didn't then just go and check the totem and then come back, we could talk about the spirits again, but let's not do that. Let's just load and continue on because otherwise I have to redo a bunch of other stuff and I missed out on a bunch of talking with Oscar before and Igor? whatnot. So, yeah. Let's just keep going from here without knowing about the shamans, which is fine. I think I want to go this way. So I guess we're just plugging the spirit hole just to uh, get Igor to give us the... What was it? What was the name? I forgot already. Shut up. Did you see something flicker in the top left there? Like a few seconds ago? That was odd. Maybe that was like a, a bird? Or maybe I was just seeing things. Wait, can I talk to Oscar? Oh, I wonder. Damn. Oh, no. I'm not gonna do it. Now I'm wondering, like... Hold Oscar? on, let's see. Yes. Oh, fucking god damn. If you now talk to Igor without having looked at the totem, and he says spirits, shamans, and then you go talk to Oscar. I found Igor Let's see. Borgoff. What? That ignoble brute? Ignoble? Who me so savagely? He seems to be terrorized by the howling wind. Oh, that lily livered. We can't all have oh, your no. indomitable courage, can we, Oscar? Oh no, I should have saved a save. Because now she said he's haunted by the wind, but we didn't know it was the wind before. Oh boy. I'll be back again. Oh boy. One more time. I am saving a save here, just in case. I don't think I'll use it now. I think we're pretty much done, but... Let's do it again. Wait, hold on. So I want to go and talk to Oscar and deplete all of his dialogue and then talk to Igor about the spirits and then talk to Oscar again. Oscar. There we go. Once again, really nice that they changed the... Uh, the speech system, where if you right-click, you don't just exit out. So you can actually skip ahead in dialogue and not just get kicked out, which was really annoying in Siberia 1. Pretty good change. Alright. Hi, Igor. Again. How are you doing this time? Hey. 
There we go. Okay. Spirits. Sure. Oh, wait, what happens if I go this way? Don't I just get taken, like, right next to the, the train? I do. I should have been going that way. That's much faster. Alright. Oscar! Again! Tell me what you think. Oscar? Yes, kid? I found it. What? That he seems to be terrorized by the howling oh. wind. Oh! But I don't know that! We can't all have your indompt. I'm off. I should. But we don't know that! But I guess we tried it out now, at least. Huh. Kind of odd. It feels like there should have been... She should have said, like, he's haunted by evil spirits, and Oscar would say, like, There's no such thing as evil spirits, Kate Walker! There must be a logical explanation for this. And then Kate says, I guess you're right, Oscar. I'll try to figure it out. Or something like that. Wait, so now we've already plugged it. And we need to just go to right. So, yep, let's go this way. Because that's much faster. But yeah, that's a bit odd. I guess that's what I get for... Trying out so many things. Hey, the spirits are gone. <gasps> They're gone. Why are you still here, Igor? Evil spirits holding me. They're very angry. You're fine. They want to keep me. But all the evil spirits have gone, Igor. Huh? Yeah, I told them to skedaddle. No, oh, no, oh. the spirits are screaming. They're not. Listen for yourself. They've all gone. Uh, no. Hey, but I can't hear them. Like I said, look, maybe you should skedaddle here too while you can. Skedaddle Thank you, here? Lady. Thank you. Time for Igor to go far away. I'm cold. I'm hungry. I go home. But where are you going? Bye, he said home! Weren't you listening? Also, is he just gonna conveniently drop the thing that we needed? Or not? He didn't even care about giving us the thing that we wanted. But yeah, I thought you had to say, like, skedaddle out of- Oh, he did drop the thing we need. God damn it. Well, so much for that. Hold on, let's try and follow the tracks instead. See how long or how far they reach. But yeah, I thought you had to say, like, I'm gonna skedaddle out of here. He skedaddled right out of there. But I guess not. I mean, it is just like, I'm gonna skedaddle. It's a bit weird. And yeah, I... I guess the tracks just go kind of over there, and we can't follow them. Huh. So, bye Igor! Now he's gone! Wait, right, this way. Oh, and they were just conveniently you placed, me up the hill. even like the right foot, on the right side. Incredibly convenient. And I can't take that out. Hold on, let's talk to Oscar again! Now that we've exorcised some spirits. Oscar? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Igor's gone. I know. I saw him from my hiding place. Oh. Let's oh. just hope he doesn't come back. Don't worry about it, Oscar. He's probably a long way away already. I'm off now, Oscar. I shall await your return, Kate Walker. Okay. Oscar. Yes. All right. 
I'll go find Hans. Let's save our game. Oh, right, that's the save I wanted to save, but it doesn't matter. Not at this point. We've gotten past, like, we've done everything in this area, so it wouldn't matter. I hope. Oh, it's like an elephant graveyard, or, well, I guess a mammoth graveyard. And go back down. Oh, you actually can. Just for the fun of it. There's no way you can miss anything below, so there's... Why would you need to go back down? And yeah, alright, just one way to go. Hi. Uh, oh, uh, shit. <laughs> Can't I just back. pick up another tusk back. as well? And fight him? <laughs> or like, throw some bones at him? Right? I'm just gonna save here. Yeah, I would just like, pick up bones and start chucking them at him. So here she is. Kate Walker. <laughs> Brave Kate. <laughs> Walker. Haha, ha, it's Hans? not my Where middle name. The old crazies disappeared. The vanishing gnome trick. <laughs> uh, really? With your brother Igor, I suppose? <laughs> Blundering fool. So he let you pass. Dumbass abandoned his guard duty then. Your brother has decided he was better off without you. He has abandoned you, Ivan. What? He's gone? Nah. <laughs> if he has, then good riddance. The tub lard only ever tied me down anyway. He was your muscle, though. Ah, that's a thing. Hold on, I'm just gonna check. What happens if I just, like, walk? Stay where you are! It's okay, it's okay. Why would I'll he... Stay right here. Why wouldn't he, like, try to poke her with a, the tip of it? I said back. Ah, okay. Don't make me get nasty, girl. No, get nasty. I told you to stay put. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Don't hold back just because I'm a woman. None of that with me, you little whore. Oh, Jesus. Okay, he's not stay holding back. Where you are. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> I told you to. All right, I think we've heard everything. Yeah, and that doesn't give you like different messages. So tell me, where is Hans Varlberg? I told you, I don't know. And what's more, I don't care. <laughs> perhaps, <laughs> perhaps he was eaten by a bear. What's it to me? You're a disgusting creature. Why are you doing this? Doing White what? Gold, sweet lips. Mammoth ivory. He didn't do anything to Hans. Crazy was well, I mean, I guess he did, way. but <laughs> and not now. And glory are all mine. <laughs> so, I mean, you have your ivory here, right? This is ivory. Like, the tusks and stuff, just take them and go. Listen, Ivan. I guess that's why he's packing them on the sled. All I want is to find Hans. Let me go. No way, my little rosy bud. You'd shoot me in the back first chance you get. Shoot and you, you want with to my tell good me looks. Why you're sitting around here? Your hobbit friend says the legendary Yukov village is someplace round here. So you see my lovely cherry pop? I shit, I watch, and I wait. But Hans is in danger. Do I look like I care? But don't you have <laughs> enough ivory? What are you expecting to find in a Yukov village? I told you to. Hey! <laughs> Where? Okay. Uh, it's okay. It's might be another 
puzzle where you use the phone because we can't check anything. I said ba and like, surely we're not using the Russian doll for anything. Nope. Nope. Yeah, I, I guess we call people. Oh, I have an idea, but I also think I might just be remembering this. I think you just call Oscar and he like honks the train to make him flinch. You have reached Marcel and Lormont Associates. Why do I even keep trying? I don't know if I'm remembering that or if that's just like an idea. I like how he just lets you call oh, people uh, on your phone. Hello. She's certainly at the Hamptons a lot. Oscar, I've got Ivan here right in front of me. And he ain't looking very friendly. You've got to come and help me, please, Oscar. I can't I leave the train. I hardly constitute a force of dissuasion, Kate Walker. I don't care, Oscar. Use your head. I, uh, oh, my, uh, I have to guard the train, Kate yep. Walker. Yep. Oscar, get up here now. Up there? Oh, but there is all this snow, Kate Walker. As you know, it is most distressing for my Oscar, I'm gonna work. fucking die. Oscar! This man oh, is ready to yep. crack my skull open, so I'm asking you to come and help me, or you'll be scooping my brains up with your metal fingers. Uh, I will see what I can do, Kate Walker. Well, do quick, Oscar. What the hell is that? I did remember correctly. You've never heard a train whistle. Funny. And the consequences will be very messy. What does this embassy want? And let's save. Walker, you take one more step and I'm going to smash your skull. But he still turns around. Walker. So I'm guessing now we can just go check the thing on the left. But we Walker. still can't talk to him or anything. All right, so now that he's not looking, let's check the sled. Oh, it's a knife. Ivory knife. Oh, oh, I see. So it's not, I thought we were like threatening him. Nope, we're not doing that. We're, we're cutting this loose and then he's gonna be like, no, my ivory. Nice try, what? street walker. Or I guess but not. This time you've gone too far. Your journey stops here. Dead. <laughs> 